Welcome to another Midweek Moment with Pastor G.M. Thompson, the pastor of New Beginning Christian Faith Center. I just would like to share this with you on today about time. You know, if you read it in Ecclesiastes, the third chapter, it talks about time. And so I just want you to meditate and think about this thought. What are you doing productive with your time? Another question, are you fulfilling God's divine purpose with your time? Time, what are you doing with it? Time waits on no one. So what are you doing with your time? And when you think about that, and so many times we go to funerals and all this, and they talk about the death and all that. But the thing is, at the death, there is judgment. We will stand before God and be judged. And you know what he's going to ask and say, what did you do with the time? I gave you so much time. I gave you 40 years, 30 years, 20, 50, 60, 100 years. Did you fulfill my divine purpose that I ordained for your life with the time you were given? Did you, you know, did you redeem the time? What did you do with the time? Did you seek me during that time? Did you serve me during that time? What did you do with that time? Did you use the time for what you wanted to use the time for? But you must realize that you are here because of me, the great and mighty Savior of the universe. Time. Time. What are you doing with your time? Are you being productive? Are you being effective? Just what are you doing with your time? Are you just wasting time? Are you just thinking time is not important? Or do you think I got a lot of time? Are you thinking about your age that you don't have to worry about time right now? You gonna wait until you get a little older? Time. Read in Ecclesiastes, the third chapter those first the eight verses and see what it says about time because God allowed Solomon to write something about the different areas of life that things happen with time and in life period that time time to live time for life time of death time to just time you just read I want you to read it for yourself I could do it for you but I don't want to do it for you I want you to read it yourself and then meditate and think about what am I doing about my time that God has given me in the earth am I doing what I need to do with the time that I was given Thank you.